Hi friends, in this video we can check how to create an e-commerce website with Mart4 e3. This is a very good theme and beautifully designed and well customized theme and very customer friendly theme. The customer can easily buy a product from your e-commerce website very easily. And just we can start the video. First go to your WordPress dashboard and you can see our default website look like this so we have to change the theme go to appearance and click on themes and click on add new and upload the map for the theme the link i will give in the description box below you can download from there just upload the map for the theme and click on install now and wait for some time to get installed once installed just activate the theme and after that you can see this much plugins have to be installed just click on that begin installing plugins and click on plugin and click on install and click on apply and wait for some time to get install all these plugins once install all the plugins just go back to the plugin installer section and just activate all the plugins and click on activate and click on apply once install the plugin go to the plugin settings again and click on add new and Upload a new plugin which is Zool Demo Importer. It is used for importing all the demos. Click on install and activate the plugin. Once install that plugin, go to your appearance and click on import demo data. And you can see a lot of demos are available. Uh, on Elementor and WP Bakery page builder and choosing Elementor demo you can also use WP Bakery just select one and import and wait for the some time to get import all the demo data once finished you can see a message like this import completed now you can go to your website and just refresh the page now you can see our website has been totally changed and it is everything works fine all the demo data has been successfully imported now you can edit everything one by one just go to WooCommerce and click on settings and you can change all the details over the WooCommerce settings page and you can select your country and you can change all the settings over here you can change your currency and click on save changes on the payment section also you can select the payments and click on save changes and go to the advanced settings and by default all the pages has been aligned correctly if you want to change you can be changed here once everything finished make sure to click on save changes now we can refresh and see the currency has been changed and it is changed to indian rupees now go to the product section and click on add new here you can add a new product for your e-commerce website you can add new product and the description of the product product image and everything you can be added here yes you can add the price short description etc this is very basic thing you can be do here you can add the price, sale price, 
and you can schedule the price for some times once you finish you can add the new category for your product i'm just adding a cricket bat so i'm adding a product category for sports and just typing cricket bat all the products you can be added here like this and you can add a product tag for the product and click on add you can add any brand for your product and you can add the image product image just upload a product image for your product set product image you can also add video url also for your product after that click on publish okay now your product has been published and you can check it out now click on view product and you can see our product has been published and everything works fine now go to your appearance section and you can change click on customize and you can change all the logo header and everything over there header section footer section and all the typing fonts and everything can be changed on the customize section you can change the logo can change the site identity means your site title tagline you can set a site icon and everything you can be changed here on the typography section you can change the font on the header section you can change the logo images for your e-commerce website After changing anything you have to click on publish then only the changes will be take place. You can change the footer like this. You can edit the breadcrumbs. You can change the footer copyright here. Let's select the copyright text and you can add your own site address and everything what you need you can be added there once you finish you can change the live changes and after that click on publish after that go to appearance and select menu and here also you can edit all the menu settings and you can change the menu settings over here or you can create a new menu over here it is very easy you can add new pages for your website I'm just adding two pages on the menu click on add to menu see the two pages has been added to our menu you can be delete or add any menu like this just click on remove and the menu, menu will be deleted and you can also assign all these places for the menu after that click on save menu Now you can edit to the front page with edit with Elementor and click on that. You 
you can edit all the textures and images change the images by clicking on that image or the text you can change all the details over there you can change all the textures images and etc etc it's very easy to do that You can change all the details over here. Once you change everything, click on update. Now we can check how the uh, website works. Just select a product and click on add to cart and type a billing address and place the order. Once you finish that, the customer will see like this as message and they will get an email notification also. After that go to the WordPress dashboard and you can select the order section on the WooCommerce. When an order delivers you will also get an order notification through email and here you can update the details of the order. The update of the order you can be changed here and click on update. Okay, thank you for watching the video.